we've got five racers lined up waiting for a signal. Over the following seven days, our group can use any transport available to them. The end goal? Arrive at the bright lights of Las Vegas, Nevada. Here's the catch. Each racer is only able to use a single form of payment. So, who will make it all the way to the finish line? All will be revealed in the payments race. I have got 2000 in one dollar. Jesus Christ. Oh, hello. This is Jessica Morehouse here. I have a chip and pen, as you can see from my shirt. I'm using contactless. My sponsor's Finastra. The thing that I'm using for my contactless is hopefully this ring. This one here. That's going to be the main thing that I'm going to try and use. The other things that I can use are Apple Pay and tap with my card. Anything else, I'm not allowed to use. So here I am at the starting line. Uh, I have received my payment method. There's Stu. He's gone. Uh, my payment method is gold. $2,000 worth. I'm ready for the race. I'm starting 2 p.m. from L51. I need to do this Today is before the race actually starts. So the first task that we've got is we need to go down into the exhibition hall and get a few sound bites from people. We need to get them wishing us good luck and giving us a tip on how we can how we can do well in the race. Oh, Mrs. Jira, what are the tips for me? Like to go to America, to go to America, across America, go to Las Vegas, and using Bitcoin. Hmm? Bo, have you got any tips for my journey for using cash? Well, yeah, we just talked about a couple. You're going to be going through the American border with $2,001 bills, so just have your story pretty secure and ready. Well, yeah, <laughs> they're going to want to check you. They're, going to, they're just going to... They're just going to ask you questions. I mean, I hope, I really hope you don't get delayed in a room somewhere uh, for no reason, but just be ready for anything. That's the tip. Thanks, General tip. Thank you. For everything. <laughs> Use your British accent, it will get you very far. Oh, there you go. North America. And should, I, I, should I make it, um, should I over exaggerate? You should over exaggerate oh, oh. it. Yeah. Hello. Like the queen. Hello. Exactly. Pretend you're the gold. queen and Prince William. Yeah. You're, you're there. You're halfway there already. Oh, Great God. advice. Yeah. You have done? Um, I've done, that's my third one. Your task for tomorrow. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. And there you go. Thank you. Okay, so my task is Jack Nicklaus Museum. Travel to location indicated. Take selfie at location wearing Ohio hat with Jack Nicklaus Museum. Okay. Who is Jack Nicklaus? Are you serious? Yes. So, my challenge is to travel to Jenny's Ice Cream at the North Market in Ohio, Columbus, Columbus, Ohio. Oh my god. Travel to the location indicated, which is Cincinnati, the Fountain Square. I'm gonna have to Google where the heck that is. Next is gonna be going ready, set, go. Ready, set, go. What you can't see is that it uh, weighs 20 pounds and I'm just walking out of the conference now and I'm going to figure out how the hell to get to Cincinnati, where Cincinnati is, and uh, how to win this thing, I guess. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go to the bus station, try and work out how to get to Columbus. I think it's about a mile walk to the coach station now, so... Although Stu seems to have packed considerably more than me. Mostly just money. <laughs> it's like follow 2000 George Washington. <laughs> so, it's already super stressful. I almost lost my lens cap in the bathroom. Uh, almost dropped the camera in the sink, in the water. And I've been talking to a couple of travel agents and they're totally unhelpful. Basically, travel agents can book me a flight that was quite expensive, over $500, um, but they don't accept tip and pin. I'm going to Union Station to see if there's a train or a bus that will take me. If not, I'm just going to have to go to the airport and see if I can buy a ticket with a tip and pin. Just talked to this 
nice lady at the information desk at Via Rail at Union Station. She suggests to go to Greyhound Station. That is where all of the buses leave from Toronto. So I'm gonna rush down there, see if there's any buses that will leave tonight to get me there tomorrow. Do you take chip and pin credit card? Yeah? Uh, like a credit card where I have to put the chip in and type in my password? Yeah, yeah. You do take that? Okay. <laughs> is about one mile away but with a bag that weighs ridiculous amounts probably about 20 kilograms I reckon this bag that's going to make that mile horrible and we got that going on so I just took a cab from right at Union Station to the bus station just because it would have taken me forever to walk here with this huge backpack. Alright, I'm coming up to the bus station now. That was a ridiculously hard walk. Hi, um, I'm looking for a ticket to Columbus if that's okay. Yep, seven o'clock. And I'm gonna move hundred dollars from inside my bag into my pocket, which means they'll have two hundred dollars in my pocket ready to pay. And I'm gonna do this in the bathroom because I don't want to be murdered. Here I am, huddled away in this dirty bathroom to get my money out. There's 100. I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. It's just bloody embarrassing. Uh, a ticket from here to Cleveland. That's your help. Thanks. successfully booked a bus ticket to Cincinnati, though it's going to be a hella long journey. This is... Hi, my name is Brendan Meeks. And this is... Alicia Grimes, hi. Okay, so um, what the guys have kindly offered to do is the Greyhound station is just around the corner, and so is the Cash for Gold. The guys here are going to change it for me, and then we're going to go for a walk to the station. They're going to book my tickets for me to where I need to be um, and the guys are going to keep whatever money is left um, just, just, for help, just for helping me out. But Brendan has now got uh, the money. Um, Brendan? Yes. So he has the money here. We are now going to go and book uh, my tickets and... Get some food. Oh, get, you get, get me some food, get me nourished. I'm on the same bus as Stu and Jordan so um, we're just gonna go and grab some food or they're gonna grab some food and I'm gonna eat half a sandwich. Pay in US dollars, yeah. US dollars? You only take 20 or less. Yeah, that's fine. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 there. Greyhound bus station in Toronto. Someone has kindly agreed to uh, accept my Bitcoin in exchange of buying a ticket. So why did you help me today? It could go up in value. Yeah. Remember, it's, there, there are only going to be a limited number of Bitcoins. Eventually, it's going to go up. Let's see something. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Thank you. <laughs> so Abbas is a real saver because he's buying me something to eat as well. 